I am here vibing with one of the living legends in dancehall music. His parents named him Norman Washington Jackson, but we know him as... Tiger! Father Tiger. Hello. All is well, sir? Long life. Mad. Percy. It's an honor, brother, brother, brother. Most friend. Bless it. There was an artist who came about who sounded like Tiger. No, like a fool. There is a word out there that you actually beat up Zebra. No, lie. No, no, God, sir. Knock in the mouth and say, call the police. Cook in the group and say, hey. Hey, you just stop, take me a key, and you just jump yeah. off of the boat. You jump off. Yeah, so cook in. And she, she jump off of the boat by taking it. He just has to say, once you start, you can't stop. You might tell you, like, stop. You stop. stop. And this is me, you say, what, Tiger, you're a good boy. You might sound so tired. Yes. But I'll be so tired so because a fire may come from fire me. Fire come from Thank the truth. Thank God we're alive. I have something to tell you. I love you, sir. I love you, sir. Yeah. I feel important. You are important, Thank sir. You. Legendary. Have and you ever gone back on a bike, Tiger? What a question. We can't answer. We can't answer. We can't answer. <laughs> answer, man. She's a real blessing. It's a bomb, bomb. Tiger, let the microphone down. Talking to them long, long, long. Hold on, man. <laughs> Teach them! Always make sure the message I reach them! The great tiger. Bless How you things, sir? Thank God I'm alive. It's great to see the man. See me. Talk to us, though. Early life. Where were you born? Uh, it's good to speak the truth. Yeah. I was born. Kingston Jubilee Hospital. Yeah. Mm. And grow. Brought up in Kingston 6 area. Kingston 6. Which community was that? That was in top side, Matches Corner. Okay. Bottom side, Papi. Yes. Across from Hope Passes and Mona. Yeah. <laughs> How many brothers and sisters you have? Two sisters and Four brothers. Two sisters and four brothers. All of them still around, still alive? Um, one died. So two of your siblings passed on. Two brothers. My condolences. Read that. Mm. Mommy and daddy still around? They, they're going to rest also. They're going to rest also. My condolences, brother, brother. Where did you attend school, though? I like the question. The yeah. first school I went to, the name of school is Lachibati. Miss Lodge School. <laughs> Excuse me, please. Yeah. It was across Standpipe. Standpipe. Over mm. Standpipe, the first school I went to. Yeah. Then I went to like a prep school um, across the church, over the, in the church. Yes. Yeah. And from there, I went to um, Mona Primary School. Mona Primary. Mm. And then from Mona Primary School, went. Poppy secondary <laughs> Yeah. And a little misfortune, yes. But I didn't graduate. Oh, you didn't graduate. I look at misfortune. But <laughs> thank God. Yeah. Um, the little misfortune based, based upon I wanted to be in my own ways yes. an entertainer. Okay. So I was all the way gone, gone, gone try to, and it, thank God, it came to be something. Yeah, so you used to leave school, go studio. Sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> so now we know the legendary Norman Jackson as Washington Jackson. Thank you. Washington Jackson mm, thank as you. one of the living legends in dancehall music. Mm. Yeah? But how did you get involved in the music though? Um I won't forget this. First, um there is this um disco. Name In Crowd Disco. In Crowd. Pick the Phillips Disco. Yeah. Right. And he's in, in Brain and Radio now. I used to go and DJ freestyle. And, yes. And people get to know me. Mm -hmm. People get to know me and tell the people about me. And that's where it developed from. Yes. And after that, I went to Black Star. Black Star. Yeah. Mm. We all like my kind of, as a short man, they all like my kind of speaking. Yes. Ground, settle. I'm boiling water in kettle, you know, kind of way. Yeah. And <laughs> so, most of being uh, a DJ, 
I'm an entertainer. Mm -hmm. They accept me, they accept me, you know. Yeah. But, Before we go back to the Black Star thing, though, how was it growing up in Kingston 6, though, from a, from a financial perspective? Was it hard for mommy and daddy to keep food on the table? And that question, no one ever asked me that. It was easy, though. Yes. But I made way yes. for them not making it harder for them. Yes, yes. So even though it wasn't easy, mommy and daddy tried to put food on the table. They never leave you out. Yes, that is good. Sounds awesome good. stuff. Yeah. So now you went to Black Star and you started, you know what I mean, freestyle and work on the south. Yeah? How was that? No. I, 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 when I was working on the Black Star sound system as a DJ, one of DJ among Brigadier Jerry, yeah. brought back and Malvo, Anthony Malvo. Anthony Lucien, Malvo, yeah. yes. Mm. So Danny Dredd. Yeah. Yeah. Be a big name. Yeah. Mm. And, and I said, okay, this is it. I'm, I'm, I'm going to stick around with Blackstar. Yes. To be one of the main artists around them. Mm -hmm. But people start loving me so much, more than it going to my head. Yes. They invite me to some uh, um, association like Tiger, who would like to make you and some other entities go too far and make some money and so on, so on, so on. Yeah. That's how me and Blackstar went to far. You know? OK. How old were you at the time? You remember? I'm in the 20s, 20s I'm sure, though. Still young. In the 20s, <laughs> young boy. Yeah. So when you, when you went to Blackstar, though, um, Sir Tiger, did you take on the Tiger name as it, or you, were, you did still go by your government name? Ah. Good question. Yeah. <laughs> you see, the tiger name was ever with me for yeah? a time. Yeah. Them used to call my father, man tiger, tiger in a ramp, you know. <laughs> 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 Alright. My first DJ name mm. is Ranking Tiger. Alright. Just, just, just a tiger. No? Give it to them musically. Mm -hmm. But my first name is Ranking Tiger. And I sing. I sang on a disco 45. Yeah. Why can't you leave? The dreadlocks are low. And then DJ, you mean so far you are alone? And let them see what they wrote. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> DJ. Yeah. That was in the 80s. We up in them. Back. We up. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. So that was your first song? Yeah, first song. Why don't why, you leave? Why can't you leave? The dreadlocks are low. Let them see for their own. Yeah. Yeah, my singer and DJ. Yeah, no, yeah. yeah. True. How well did that song do? Though? All right. To my experience. Yeah. It's not well big, big, but the promoter, the producer, took it to foreign country. Yeah. There was some establishments, you know? Yeah. It, it, it did okay overseas, but not so great in Jamaica. They're sure about that. That's mm. true. So you were still on the sound system at the time? You know, people started hearing about this tag and I you hear know, I perform. Yeah. And start me with a smile. Like you, you have a, um, a one time a Virgo come on. Um, Manjaro, man, I, I keep him down. Killer Manjaro? Yeah. Yeah. Why? You have five DJ come with Jaro, then we invite Tiger over there. Yes. That was amazing. At the same time, I was down by standpipe. I was in a lawn and on my sound. Three stone. So I black star alone. Yeah. Sent up, sent up. Mm -hmm. They keep they kept a, a sent up then two black star was going to find. Oh, okay, cool. And it was nice, it was yes. nice. Yes. So I like a mash it up. Well <laughs> man I come man, man, I come, man I come take a listen and done. Yeah. So I'm going to try pop right here. Be a gunshot. So, <laughs> <I'm at them laughs> Thank you Lord. Right. Yeah. So and people let me start discover tiger you know. Yeah. I'm, you know, I, I try to control myself. I know that I must get headlighted and yeah. too excited. You know? mm. so what I can do the best of my ability and go through. So what you know, Father Tiger? Um, why don't you leave Dreadlocks alone? Was the first official song you recorded. You're going to the studio, of ice. Yeah. Who brought you to the studio to do that song? Um, I'm a person named Philip Grant. In more. Mm, Philip Grant. No, I forget him. Yeah. What was that experience like though, going to the studio for the first time? Me just want 
accept the experiences of your experience and know so why. You have to do to the best of your ability. Mm -hmm. And I went to school, creation school. Um, yeah, creation school. Creation studio. Yeah. The first song that they recorded, Sir Tiger, yeah. um, why don't you leave the dreadlocks alone? Why did you do that song? I tell you the I was a nasty dreadlock. Song. Yeah? <laughs> I'm a little bit like why now? Yeah. Believe me, I'm speaking on television, I'm speaking to you. Yeah. But Babylon in my seat, the Babylon police man say, if you don't cut that, I will cut you wrong. <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah. Now cut this, you know, I'm going to try to cut me wrong. Yeah. That's how I cut it myself. Oh, you cut it yourself? No, I'm going to buy myself. Give me a chance. When bro. did you cut the year, though? In the 70s. In the 70s, yeah? But you started out Tiger as a singer, not a DJ. Believe me now, that's the place mm. where I was first. Yes. Being a singer. Yeah? And say, what? Well, I want to be an entertainer. Mm. From that time, yeah? But I say, what? I'm going to try something, man. Yeah. So don't want to stand by it. And I'm going to say, puppy love, puppy love. Tiger now, I give puppy love. <laughs> I love you, mommy. I love you, daddy. I try also to love everybody. Yeah. And then people say, I love you, DJ. You know? yeah. Don't stand by me and say, I'm not going to People start accept me yeah. more than ever as a DJ. DJ. So yes. that is how you made the transition from singing to DJ now. So Puppy Love was your first real hit song then, Tiger? Yeah. Yeah? And I say, I feel so good because people are there all over and foreign. All over. Yeah, them times you now people start no tiger and producers wanted to voice tiger. Yeah. yeah. And you know it's nice. That song. Puppy Love. Yes. I am love it. I love to speak the truth, you know. I heard a song. This is not a puppy love. So you know. But Tiger. You need Tiger you can't get puppy love. <laughs> 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 no ice cream is fine. Like, yeah. Everything good, man. <laughs> what was it? Eh? Puppy love, puppy love. Quang, quang. What's wrong? I ain't that bad. I'm in pretty good shape. Sorry, fellas. Only good to show for that is all. Thank you, fellas. What do you call it? Puppy love, puppy love. Take it out of your ass, Yeah, my thing. God, I love you, mommy. I love you, daddy. Why do you love me, buddy? Yes. So now, that song came. Did it reach number one? I don't remember that. No. But it did very well. Very well. Yeah? People, people here. Yes. But I'm, I'm sure for this. Mm. What did that song do for you do as an entertainer back then? Thank you for asking the question, sir. According to me, it opened the windows and the door then. Yes. For Tiger to mm. be one of Jamaica's entertainers. Yes. Come here, Holly, that's why Bob Marley and um, when you get two ten meters, and Rice Shirley and them long time man. You know? Yes. Long time. Mm. And some American singers too. Yes. Right? So me I really love me singing you now. So do that's where my roots, you know. Yeah. Thank when Poppy Love came out, did you you started flying yet? As in you left Jamaica to perform before no. that? No. So when when did that opportunity come? When did you leave the country for the first time to, to perform? Okay. They had a four song. Crash. Yes. Up here. This is Jamaica's University, you know, right? Yes. Student Union, four song crash. Metro Mila Top, you know, Black Star and Sturmall, four song crash. Yeah. And Mr. Leng, after Leng, I him put on the dance, you know. You mean Leng from Sting? Yes, my brother. And yes, we win Black Star with Tiger. Your son. And they win one. You mash it up. Whoa. Yeah. Thank were you God. the only DJ on the sound at the time? No. No, but you were a part of it. But to my, to my explosion yeah. of, of works, people miss unto me. So are you take a clash? Yeah. <laughs> and I thought, so, yeah. Yeah. Even though you had, um, you had Nicodemus, them kind of DJ, the band. Funny how that's her, man. Yeah. yeah. Me, you know. Uh, yeah, <laughs> the style and pattern is yeah, different. Yeah. yeah. So now, after the clash and puppy love, which was the next song where really and truly take on to the streets where the people them accept and it was a hit song. 
comeback to me. Not mal to me. Shake up. So you are Anthony Malvo. Wanga got came before come back to me? Thank you for helping. Yeah. Wanga too far. <laughs> Wanga. So Wanga got came before. Yeah. What was the thought though, or what led to the creation of Wanga God? Yeah, tell the truth, I tell the truth. Now I had some friends. Say, yeah, 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 right? Yeah. But when certain things never come for you, they want them to no, no, no. <laughs> I mean, you can't let them know. Yeah. You know, Wanga God. Yeah. So then Wanga God. Yeah. So and it wasn't a food thing then, Tiger? It was about friends wanting yeah. things from Tiger? I mean, no, I mean, build the video. That way, you know, Yeah. Aye, you see, you see the video you now. Some people, oh, a groom of some, you know. Mm. But, yes, you know. The man who named um, Norris, them call him Wanga. Him, I, <laughs> I saw the video, you see the video. Yeah, well. One man get pies, you know. <laughs> nice. Now, he's a, he's a police man, so I'm like, you know. Yeah. The influence, you know. Did the sign get the name? Okay, okay, okay. And for my, my, um, as a human being, you know, that make me more recognized, you understand? Know, yeah. A police man picking a bad man. Yeah. Yeah. So the song led to that, though. But the song now, um, Tiger. No one got got one of the legendary songs of the space, you know, yeah? And you wrote that song because you say you have people around you where when Tiger just emerged, yeah, them happy, yeah? I and them want... They like them really pretending, see things. They're only pretending. Man. Yeah. You remember the song? But... No one got got. I'm not happy to know. You give me peace right now, man. No! We can't take the people, see? Because them people licking it too much, licking it too much. And we sell like a mark of the price of it. So don't beg them friends. Do it here. No one got good. No one got bad. No licky licky. No nami nami. Remember, give a lama saying, lose in moon. Tiger is the king. See the barn in June. No one in the bubble. Tiger room. Come in, nami nami. I'm not licky licky. I mean, no one can say that five things to me. Yeah. Yeah. So, Tiger now at the streets. Where are you? Were you still with the sound at the time or you had moved over to Shakin Vibes by then? Shakin Vibes, I was going over there now. But I would record for Shakin Vibes. Oh, you had record for them? He did now. What do you think, man? I went to him. You know him? Robert. We produced a Bino one. Yes. Record that. So now Wanga got came out and as we say, Tiger Town Star really. Young youth said we. So the girls they used to run down the DJ. Yeah? I love the interview you now. <laughs> Because if there's no room, you know, yeah. I won't be around. Yeah. And one of your girls back then was Pinky. One of them. <laughs> <laughs> and Pinky is the sister of dancehall queen, Carly. Yeah. Being a man, girl. So that song now, based on some readings, was done for Pinky. Mm -hmm. Yeah, talk to me about, about that now. Which aspect of it you want to talk about? Let me give you. How come you end up doing the song for Pinky? All right. Because I can't do my heart. Yeah. My heart said, Car Pinky. Car Pinky, do for me. Car Pinky, if I'm this up. Yeah. Is it that you the relationship was there, but you did give yourself some trouble and Pinky won't leave? I'm trouble and I'm <laughs> You know, we can't go and make trouble because you know, love me, you know. Yeah. So, you can join a tolerance crew too. Yeah. So, maybe if uh, I had a little more tolerance to her movement, we'd be together. I don't know. <laughs> you love there? Well, I know the unpacked. <laughs> <laughs> so no, it was because the relationship did kind of get a little weird while well, you do that song there for winning her back. Yeah? No? So hold on. What was what, what the best thing with that shoot? You shoot my heart, man. <laughs> In some ways. In some ways. <laughs> yeah? So you are mal for going to the studio and the song forward out. But yes, no. You see that song there? I mean, my pop, when we talk jumble, that song no, was just to show people how people can stay, you know, all right? I mean, you know, we can't be, but you can't be, you know, like how we want you to be. Yes. So, we have no to have a little bit, because we go. Hmm. So, so the song now was an attempt to smooth over things with Pinky. Well, it couldn't work. Couldn't work. Don't try Why it couldn't one. work? 
Yeah, I'm going to go and have a film now with her. Okay. But she was in the video, though, Tiger. Oh. Pinky. Pinky was in the video, Pinky and Carleen. Come yeah. back to me. Yeah. yeah, man. yeah, yeah man. So, it's still all right then, man. We found them together. We found them together. Yeah. Some people like the good things there, what's there now? Yeah. Give me your piece of your song, you know. Which song? Come back to me. Ah, oh, that man. Yeah, man. Summer love is beautiful. But it's, it's not really enough. enough. Instead of my emotion that I share with you, no. I wish that love is beautiful. It's, come. it's just a tender for my own to have blessed you. No, the mercy. Hey, come back to me. Come back to me. Check out the fuck. I still love me. Love me, I know I love me by my side. Don't run away. I don't want to cry. See that that guy you mean, no. He's not going to show you how much I care. Take it away. I'm going to make that bubble. And then I close my eyes as he goes. Big chew. One of them. One of them. I want to them for chew, man. Thank you. Yeah, I want to them for chew. So, another hit song that. Because it comes like early out in the journey, though, Tiger. Everything your voice hit. You know, that's what I have to pray. Please get out of the way. Yeah. Be your tune. Hey, Pasi and you girl Gwen. He said to me, when? I tell you what I go. Yeah. Me go to England now. And fortunately, me go near the club. Yeah. We can't touch the club with the lock you up, bro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, we spend two months, two months. Stop girl on, you can't touch me. Mm. So, yeah. Oh, I you go near Big Ben. Mm. I'm thinking I sing about you in a bedroom. <laughs> Are you just buy the song? Thank God you went to go to. It's hey, boss, yeah, you girl, Gwen. Are you so teeth so good? I mean, Jay. Are you so full of them? Zed, come again. again. <laughs> <laughs> Where the clock is all on that name? What are you? You want to hear it? Again. So it's nice you and your friend. See? Come again. Who knows who needs them? Tiger come to tell them that I'm all cool. Mad. One next hit song. Because I'll be it's something we talk about come right up you know. At this time Tiger was arguably the biggest DJ in a dance hall music. Yeah. Yeah. And you were flying now, you were you were performing because you said when was inspired by your visit to England and you see Big Bed. So you were traveling overseas now. Yeah. Every producer wants vice you. I almost no like, no like, you can't stop that. Everyone mm. in Peter Tiger will talk about. Yeah, life change over now. Well, it's true, I've accepted, I know we are doing the very into it, you know. Mm. The jewelry came, the cars came, the girls came. Yeah, some of them fell on my way, so I think. <laughs> <laughs> but Tiger was living the life, the star life. I love that, yeah. Yeah? Tiger was high flying, as I said, you know, one of the main men of the dance hall space, the big name, right? When did you started working with Shocking Vibes. How did that come about? Ah, tell us how it come about. From a long time you now, I always want to be in a big league. Yes. So I run down and go to class too. Bro. Oh. You see? Yes. And of course, it's a go to class. Right? Me, them, them, in a one big yard. You know, yes. I've been to the long mm -hmm, time. Mm -hmm. You have, you have pentos, Upstairs, I have chucking wire. Yes. You no know, one big compound. One big compound. Yes. Yeah. Mm. And Patsy gave me say, Tiger that and he said one good point of him. Oh, okay. That's what I'm going to do. He didn't know. But I mean, Jack, Jack, Jack Rice now, he didn't even who passed at that time. Mm -hmm. And you know, once my life was such a lonely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bam, 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 say, you know, make up on it, you know. Yeah. Then, what you take, bam, bam? This is squawk, squawk. Yeah. And gun, thank God, you see? I recorded Jeremy and Penthouse. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Which song you recorded with Jeremy, with Donovan? I sang, singing song and DJ song. Which, which was the DJ song? We're going down Music Street. I want to, remember, right? right? One, I was singing, singing song there. We're going down music street. We got to go. Don't have a delay. Hey. Get him woo. We got to go now, 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 now. Like Royce Shirley singing. Yes. Mm. So, you basically work for everybody at the compound then, Tiger. From Penthouse to Gossip to Shocking Vibes. One of them, every one of them. Yeah. 
Man, God. Which was your favorite producer to work with at the time, though? Oh. Um, all right, you have, you have Robert Livingston. Where do you call Boombastic for? Big man, bro man, jammy. Oh, uh, jammy. Oh, uh, so you recorded Boombastic for? Jammy. Jammies, yeah? So you were, so, cause one of the things, you know, Tiger, some of the artists them back then. Tell again, too. Yeah. You recorded with King Tubbies. Tubbies, Jammies, Gussie Clark, mm -hmm. Donovan Jeremy. Wow. Steely and Cleavy. Steely and Cleavy. Oh, oh, oh. Sly Boom, and Rabbi. Everybody. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, Everybody. Mike, hold on. So all of the legendary producers in the building, Tiger, you have worked with. Everybody. Harry J. Jesus Christ, Harry J, no. He me no problem. Harry <laughs> no problem? He no problem, guys. How? You don't know. I was supposed to do something for him, you know. Yeah. And him come with a thing, say, at them time, say, me, say, I don't work off your old producer. <laughs> and they, they every time I saw something else get out, I don't say I work off him. Okay. Oh, so you never actually do a recording for him? I don't know. Oh, cool, no man. Cool, no man. Cool, no man. So, Boomba Sticks. Jammies. Jammies. King Jammies. King Jammies. Yeah? Yeah. yeah? Give me a piece of that, no man. Boomba Sticks. And then she got parrot. I'm going to say, I'm going to look bad, man. Oh, she's on the television. Yeah. No! Boomba Sticks. Tiger Boomba Sticks. Hey, oh, hey, oh, I'm bombastic. Take a bit, take a bit, take a bit. I'm going to trip. Fly a pound plane. I'm going to trip. Tell that guy, you're fantastic. Yeah. You also did songs like Ram Dance Hall. Bow down with it. Ram Dance Hall. Yeah, you did co um, collaborations with people like Super Cat. That's a big, big song, that. Big, big song. Yeah. How oh, that song came about, though? What? Well, America. America, right? Yeah. Um, people up in the um, CBS, Blue Card and Shooter. Yeah? Yeah, my friend. Yo, why Tiger and Tiger and Tiger and Tiger and Cat Dolce? Yeah. <laughs> and they will, they will take no long time. No time. Right away. And the tune ready. Right away. Yeah. Then they will be like, me so. They will be like, me so. They will be like, I'm far me go. We come back to the moon and I so, hold on tight, I don't know what, let it go. <laughs> what yeah, are mad. <laughs> mad thing. Yeah, yeah, big, big song again. But you were also one of the first dancehall artists to a tiger to really cross over because they did a song with um, Fat Boys. That's one. What about Q-Tip? Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> me want to know, I'm blinded still. Me don't want to talk about it, but... Take a hint, get straight down what's cooking and bit. If you are the gas, me and the friend, now go start with a bit. Like the two kind of youth, you do want to say. Go check me here this morning. This is Tiger Wop Wop. Because the sun get red, the hair get hot. We run like a melting pot. Mad. All the, all the collaboration with Fat Boys came about though. Who responsible for that? Fat Boys, them. Eh? Yeah. Leng supposed to want to touch you. Know? Leng again? I them man around the thing. You know? Yeah. Big room, you know? <laughs> Was that song recorded out there or overseas? Them two parties. Oh, so you do yours, them do for them and then put and it together. Them on, really. Okay, cool. How oh, that song did do? From a from a, a financial perspective. You make the money off of your song there? No. How oh, come? Cool. Because they don't want to give me on some land that you can see it. Sight it up. Sight it up. Tiger hmm? was running dance hall. Some part tight, yeah. Some part tight. One of the biggest artists in the business. Yeah, it can be a one girl. One, one. <laughs> yeah. yeah Driving the nicest vehicle. As a matter yeah. of fact, there is some word on the street that Tiger was probably the first, one of the first artists to own a Benz in the business. It's, it's like I was talking about the motor vehicle. Yeah. It's nice, you know, sir. My Mercedes Benz was not regular Mercedes Benz. It was like an Escort Mercedes Benz. S-Class. No, Escort. Yeah. Small, small the one. Small one. Yeah, the small. Yeah. Small Mercedes Benz. It come like, like a car. It's a 190. 190, yes. But they didn't come with 200 now. Yeah. So you were one of the first artists. But Levi is smart. Levi is smart. That one. Big, big bed don't care that, you know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Tiger was a jewelry man. Yeah. Because I've done interview with artists and them said, can not remember Tiger riding a studio with him chain on him bike tank? Big chain. Oh, because at the time, you know, listen, at the time, 
in my bedroom. Yeah. Yeah, I make money. You be sure to be say. Yeah, make yeah, money. money. <laughs> one here, one here. You know. Make sense. Yeah, happy look like an artist. You don't want to be one represent one, so. Yeah. Me crack up finger sometimes. Mm. Yeah, man. So. And you had, you have four kids. Thank God for them. Two boys, two girls. Yes. And God. their mother would have left them, basically. Well, because certain circumstances, I don't want to know about. Yeah, man. But you were the one who was responsible for, for growing them. Thank God I keep it so I have to do. Growing two. two. Yeah, two out of the four. The first two. The first two. The first two. So, so how old were they when you actually started becoming the star in the space? Yeah. They were young at the time? Young, young. Young, young. Mm. So how you manage to balance studio, stage, show, all of them things that were the youths them? Yeah, but they did the right hands. That big guy just to me see. He's not going to put it in God don't know it, you know. Yeah, man. So, late 80s, early 90s, Tiger. Big, big, big DJ. Bow down with the air, Shaggy. What am I saying, Shaggy? You going to say something here? Yeah. Bow down with the air, go to Ramban, God! <laughs> yeah. You also did collaborations with Gregory Isaac. Yeah. Yeah. Bridget, big man, Bridget. Legendary track again. So now Tiger, I mean, you had the music at your feet, so to speak. You understand? Every artist want to be like Tiger, every producer want to voice Tiger. Yeah? Remember, we said that you started out now, you were one of the first entertainers to purchase a Benz, but you also like bikes. So you, you yeah. love bikes. Yeah? yeah okay. But your love for bikes, Tiger would have also. No. People, people. Man, burn me because I love bike more than fear people can ride bike. Yeah. Me could be seen. Because the accident, they want to lick me and fight and slap me on the track. So I couldn't ride too hard, but I'm blame, I'm blame me. Yeah. But we soon come to that door. So mm. now, after Pink, you tell me so you love Pink, you know, but that never worked out. And you, uh, you met a, another girl by the name of Donna Thompson. Yeah? Mm. So Donna. Was you had met Donna a few months before that unfortunate accident, right? Mm -hmm. Talk, do you remember the circumstances though which led up to, the, to that fateful day? Well, it was the 18th of January 1994. Mm. Yeah. You, you remember the circumstances that day that led up to that unfortunate incident? Medical terms, we are all right, but the people around me, some of them are all right. Yeah. So, I'm married from our tree. The person who claims to say them a foreigner turned from me. Go into the bono. When she called her stop and make me pass. But she turned from me because I can't do me, she won't kill me. So you yeah. actually saw the vehicle or you just drove out on it? Yeah, but I believe that stop impact and don't move. Right. You have to take it, you know. The way the car was turned. Alright, the car come. The car turned exactly like my body. You have to take it. And try down dead. Were you riding fast? No. Because many people said that you were showing off and dilly dallying in a that tiger and a ride fast, you know. That can't work. So you weren't riding fast? No. See, but I'm serious, Tom. Yeah. It'd be something that ride fast movie. What I heard from people that saw him say that, like, he might come down and it's a hesitation with the boat. Boat vehicles? Yeah. He might drive like she and got and. Mm. Like, you, never, you ever drive it and somebody, you are saying Yeah, man, you are saying, yeah. Yeah, mm. so decide to go at the same time. Wrong time. You are wearing a helmet? No, I'm not wearing a helmet. You have them in <laughs> No, I'm not kidding me, but I'm going to see something. You see, sing funny. Yeah. The thing? No, I'm not going to die for life. See? Doctors pronounce it dead, actually. I'm not sure. Him, hold on. I'm not tired of that. Yes. Him, we never ride back again. That's what the doctor said. Me say, all right, cool. Certain person, I think, I might go ride back again. I said, whoa. <laughs> yeah. The doctor yeah. did pronounce him dead, yeah? The doctor pronounced you dead. So you are a dead man. How long were you in hospital for, though? Yeah. It was a state that I said, it's got, it's worth a first car. I was in a state at the time that I said, I bet time you go going to dead in a car. Them situations are mixed up. But God makes the truth, you know. Because mm. I got my reach one time from, from the hospital to my house. I'm going to my house. I never like up my house, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, as I said, 
You want to walk one to mental health, you know? Certain things can stick you up, you know? Certain things in life can stick you up, you know? Because the accident stick me for a whole lot. Yeah. Come and say something, you know? You make me see. For the claims there, you know, but never, you know, you don't need to do for the So you people that were around when Tiger did all right and money and make disappear. <laughs> what a coincidence. You see? Mm. So, you better make sure you know what I say, you're not gonna like you, you know. Because they do what they want to do already, you know. So yeah. you know what I mean, you know what I'm saying? Because you don't because you don't drive, you know, for you. Mm. You have to think, you know, I guess think. So it was rough, health-wise. What? And you were at the University Hospital of the West Indies? Only. Yeah. I never got my name. You never got my name. How long were you actually in the hospital for? Do you have any idea? Months. Months. Yeah, thank you. Intensive care. Intensive. Yeah, thank you, Lord. <sighs> so you're you're in coma and you were in intensive care for about four months. Excuse me, you may never tell me to tell almost it. See, it's a rough process. But I mean, they never easy now. You want to come to this place? You can't come because I believe I look for you. Shut them out. Yes. So what was it like, though, in terms of covering medical costs at the time, though, Tiger? Because you were an artist, depending on going to the studio, go record, going on the stage to perform, but you were now confined to a hospital bed. So the money wasn't coming in anymore. I tell you, it's good when you work and use your brain and save. Yeah, so you, you had savings. That broke my bank book, though. But, but hospital time and, and treatment Thank God. emptied your bank account. Yes, that's it. So the money, the money dwindled so much that you actually had to borrow to cover some of your hospital costs. So I ask you a question, though, about Tiger. You, you had many entertainer friends at the time. You and many of the men you used to par and work together. None of the men never come to your head and said, Tiger, I know the situation now. See a little thing here. Put to your doctor bill. My partner come and bring it None of the producers of them. Look at you, I'll see what you ask me about, you know. That part of the brain and say. None of the producers of them. I'm gonna think about it. Are they kinky? How many of the answers are right now? Not coming to brain and say. Embarrass it, not coming to brain and say. Words on this. I'm supposed to be in one out there, not coming to brain and say. Yeah. He knocked me to you. Can I get a fire to come out with fires? A laser, a cure of fires. Not coming to brain and say. Mm. It bother me up, I mean, nah, stop being strong, because I want to build you, look at them. So none of the men them were supposed to be your oh, friend, not no show up? They were invented, so they were not supposed to be your uh, friend. Excuse me, yes, I remember there was this uh, fundraising thing oh, yes, no, yes, yeah. no. that yeah. yeah. they are trying to get artists to come together to do a fundraising for that. And the artists not come. And Bunty Killer came and he just had to go and back and say, Rodney the General. Bunty Killer like me now. My general letter to the tiger. So my brain is going to move, man. Crowd. When the thing got really rough financially, there was an effort to hold a fundraising event for you up by Pulse, led by Kingsley Cooper. But none of the artists, them, with the exception of Bounty Killer and probably a few others, mm. turn up. Mm. But they know why. They don't really want me to come forward. You stick out. So none of your, your bridging them turn up? They're not supposed to, I'm not sure of. Oh, they're not supposed to. But the warlord, Bounty Killer was there. Present Caesar! Come some people, man. You don't know, like a life, you don't like a life. You know some people. You say June, man, like yourself. <laughs> Bounty, no killer. <laughs> killer. Yeah. Real general. Real, man. I came out one time, man. Even father, I'm going out. Are you there? Yeah. Are you the father? Word on the street, though, Tiger, that the driver of the vehicle that hit you off the bike was a US diplomat. Did she actually come to the hospital to visit? Well, I might. Two for the experience, never even think. Never think about me, because I'm being a common thing, man. They never wouldn't existed. Yeah. So did she, did, she, did she not come to a tiger because she probably was fearful that somebody around you would have probably hurt her? I can't tell me, me like a question, the can't tell you again. It is so shit up, 
She not come. She not come. You burn. Look like that hurt you do, Tiger. What burn? Mm. Thank God, yeah? Yeah, man, that's simple, much, man. He pull up. He said, I used to know I've been dead without dead, but look at you. Have you spoken to her any time at all since the 18th of January 1994? She couldn't make me feel like a bit better, say. she never wanted to me on the bike. So everything that she did was through the lawyer. She never come to you and say, my apologies, X, Y, Z, we hope the recovery process is why and some. Nothing. Nothing about going to court. Oh, nothing. So there was an out of So there was an out of court settlement ten years after the accident. Yeah. Or, that them say. That them say. What you say? Them rob me. Them rob you. Can you can't pay me. Yeah, not to get in, into the actual figures though, but no. you weren't satisfied with the settlement. I like to see your good you. <laughs> How can I be a kid now? So you weren't satisfied with the settlement because in reality, Tiger, you would have lost a decade of your life trying to recover from that accident. Whoa. Yeah? So you, you, you couldn't go perform, you couldn't go record. Oh, let the people who build me up, let the people who build me up. You know. Hello. So, so, so what you know, why do wasn't there a situation where you had a lawyer where you try to fight? Because you would have lost considerable earnings over that 10 year period there. Yeah? You want to hear my part about that? Talk to me. me. I'm making you know, The whole criminal. Yeah. You came in our bars. But don't talk like this. But the world is criminal. Mm. You know? I'm not thinking, I'm talking just how it is. Yeah, so watch her now. A few months before the accident, Donna Thompson came in her life. She was your common law wife at the time. She, she would have stuck with you. Accidentally? She would have stuck with you during the accident and during the, re the recovery stage. She was there. She was also there during the settlement. Well, my mom saying this. She was there, but she wasn't there. She was there, but she wasn't there. You also left Jamaica for a while. I look a portion of time, yes. I look a portion of time. Dana was with you? Maybe. <laughs> I was there, but the mind. But the mind was there. Shut up, Tiger, shut up. We know. Yeah. Thank God for life, you know. You hear me now? Come and hide it, you know. Uh. So it sounds like Dana wasn't there, though, Tiger, out of genuine care and love, mm. but for what she might have been able to. A person, man, because what do you say now? Now, what do you say now? I bet I make me know, you know. Yeah. But she not. So, Father Tiger, when the settlement came, you were with Dana Thompson at the time. Yeah, mm. but no information problem. is out there that. All the money that was agreed in the settlement was signed over to her and not to you. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. So it means then that you don't know how much money you get, you don't see the check, you don't see nothing. You know, I wasn't supposed to see that I don't see it. Yeah. She also you know, took you and, and you guys went overseas. You know? Yeah. We have team in some high places, you know? Yeah. So basically then, Tiger, based on what I see here, so she would have used your status to benefit herself financially. Yeah, yeah. But you may find finally say, me was a real idiot. I don't know what I eat after Because something came out. Yeah. I know what I see there. Yes. Come and say, oh, yeah. She could have used me like me and her boyfriend while she takes something from my head. Yeah. Yeah. You were away. You were in England. And she would have also gotten employment with green sleeve through my recommendation through your recommendation i probably am sitting there but people are wanga from all anger sir. so she was one of the true wanga true true but i have to tell about this one no? yeah she had to be you know because her brother who was my brother you know? yeah eventually you came back with 30 pounds in your pocket mm -hmm. so you left her over there and she put you out me come out, you know. You come out. Why did you come out, though? That's not where I'm fitting at all. That's not where we were supposed no. to be. So you decided to come back home yeah. because that is not where, in your head, you were supposed to be. True. But you came back a broke man again, Tiger. Well, better me come home broke than they are fine like a coot. And they're happy. 
I'm very unhappy. Make a lot of sense. I never want to see me there. It's worse. Yeah. Me, I play guilty people myself, that's not right. Mm. But thank God for life, you know? Thank God for life. So despite the accident though, you're still able to remember your songs. Hey, that's what I praise God. You know? Cause even though I'm a bag of trouble in front of me, I've come to this and turn to me. Yes. Thank God for life, you know? You give thanks. Every time, for God, you know? Yeah. You would have worked many places though. Tiger, many, well, many places. Many people know that. Where's I, your favorite place to perform? Eh, me not tell you like. Me love go certain Caribbean. Yeah? Why? Some of them remind me of Jamaica. Makes sense, makes sense. God, no. Yeah. <laughs> me pull me up. I'm going to tell you this now. Since I go to LA, California. Yeah. Me some people. You love it there too. Hey, maybe you think you would meet them, you meet some people up there, so. Yeah. Some people you not sit you on television where you go carry mm. you, you meet them personally. Yeah. So watch you now. Of all the stages you have walked and you performed though, Sir Tiger. Which stage are the biggest stage in terms of the crowd in front of you that you can remember? The biggest crowd you ever performed for? <sighs> Tell the truth. One time. One time, one time, it will be sting. Sting. One time. Yeah. But you know, I'm going like, to recognize Tiger. I'm going to go for a tour. Yeah. I'm going to do me can. The sun for some tour. Eh? Yes. I'm going to say, the kind of people, the amount of people who went away because they want to hear Tiger. I'm going to say, yes, God. Accept it. Yes. Because enough people want to hear Tiger. And no fans say, yeah! I'm, yeah. You know, mm. In America. Hey, last one, remember me and Leroy Smarter, come on, last one. Leroy. Because people love Leroy Smarter. Yes. Tiger. Father Tiger. Yeah. You have a million hits, brother. Yeah? Oh, which, which one of these? Oh, two. Of all the hits that you have had, though, which one of them has done the best for you from a financial perspective? Which song for you make the most money? I can't tell me, my price is better than now. Yeah. If I see a new girl, Gwen, come on, Gwen. When? when? And second, I put second one to. Which one that? Come back to me. That, let me see. But you can do third one, boom, bass, stick, shaggy, teeth. Yeah, what do you mean, shaggy, teeth? No, I mean the idea of boom, bass, stick, I mean first. Are you boom, first with it? Two no one say fantasy. I say, Bumba Sam is fantastic, that's like a pirate. Yeah? So Shaggy never mm -hmm. link you and say you're an elder. <laughs> Think about that, Kabi. Yeah? He could leave me now. Yeah. He produced a me a long time before he record mm. up in New York. So he wants to be a thief and steal my idea. He's a long time South America, so what? Yeah. And nobody from, um, who was representing you ever reached out to Shaggy and I said, artist XYZ, but you know, at the Great Tiger, they Hello. come with this, so I mean, for benefit. Was I accidentally asked? No one will complain to me about me. Hello, that thing, please. Mm. Mm. Something mm. Oh, God. Like, who knows? Who knows? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, my one. My one. No, 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 no reason. My one. Uh, and then I big up that. No, 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 no. Look at Yeah, I said that Bombastic, you are the first artist of Vice Bombastic because they never want to say fantastic. You and Shaggy come too, yeah. and him use it and they never reach out and you never benefit from it no way at all. No, I benefit from it, no, but not a good way. The not bad a good way. Another, another big song where I have heard um, a, an artist kind of sample is popular. You benefit from that either? You know why you mean? You go around that. Yeah. No. So nobody Stop from that. nobody from Sean Paul camp never reach out to your re popular. Then not propose because I'm a bike and a tiger. Mm. That's what I see. So popular now I'm would have that, been yeah. sampled by Sean Paul. Yeah? Um, yeah. Uh, I understand that steps are being made for you to benefit from that financially. That's good, cause yeah. Sean Paul, it's not good, good if you don't give me something more. Yeah. I want a good. <laughs> and there are other songs out there that Tiger has done that has been sampled by other entertainers. But you're not benefiting from those from those things, Tiger. And I'm telling them, say, 
before them remember I said, you're not supposed to walk out, keep what you do to see the voice squeeze here. Mm. You hear that? Keep what you do to see the voice squeeze and go out freeze you. Yeah. Believe so me? those are your three biggest songs commercially, but of all the songs that you have done, Tiger, which song is your favorite song? Or that song that you made the most, that song that come back to your most regular, or if you're humming in your quiet time? All right, man, let me know the secret part. Do that. Hey, boy, see how you girl queen. Yeah. I used to teach you grow up with you. I used to have a lock of flowers with them. Anyway, come again. Do you have to go to Japan? When? What kind of money is paid? Yen. Five or four nine. Do you want to make ten? See. Say, I need to manage my ten. See, anyway, come again. Why the one is your favorite one? Because. Don't, I can't do my inspiration. Yeah. I went to Japan the second time. That's the third time. I'm going to see one dreadless baby. I go so weird, and I got him made the truth. Yeah. Believe me, I'm going to go on. That means that. Baby, love it, son. Ah, baby, love it. Everybody have to love it. Thank God, I'm so sorry. Yeah. Come and see, dreadless baby. See, if I see you, you are great. Love it, man. It's good. Yeah, be good, man. So that one that one that resonates with you. You mean, yeah? Mm. Before the accident, Tiger, you were focusing primarily on music. But if you weren't DJing or singing leading up to the accident, what is that one career where you then say, Tiger, do something else outside of music, if it wasn't music? Yeah, lad. Of course, it's also a long time problem. Now, I'm saying, you know. Actor. That, but yeah. <laughs> that would be a suit of it, you know. God, thank you. Yeah, that would be a suit of it, you know. Yeah, see it. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, me I see it. Mm. No, music, you used to do the acting. Yeah, you used to do the acting. Before but the music. You couldn't get the financial support for a jumper. Oh, you couldn't get the support. You couldn't get the support. You couldn't get the support. Yeah. Because people would say, you don't want to eat it, make something up for the eat it. But I don't want to eat it. Come out of that. I'm waiting for that time. Come on. Yeah. Tiger, mm. looking at the journey though, on a musical level, what would you say is your greatest achievement? That thing that when you look upon it and say, yeah, I may achieve that something. There. You feel proud of. As an item? Yeah, any, anything where you where you proud of, where you achieve out of the music. Thank you, my life. Your life. How so? Because some things happen, shouldn't happen. Yeah. And some things happen, never should happen. Yeah. I mean, because I mean, somebody look at a little bit and a little bit that, it's stubborn. Yeah. I'm a little fan that, you know. Mm. Would you do anything differently if you get the chance to redo the entire journey musically? Is there any one thing where you say, yo, I'm sorry, I'm going to do that something there? One thing. Sorry, sorry for me to do it. Mm -hmm. uh, what you then do differently if you couldn't do it over? Believe me, I'm sorry for crash, man. Sorry for crash. Mm -hmm. But you know why? I'm sorry for my job. The person with me, everybody knows me a crush me, you know. I'm yeah. crush me. You think so? We know that, man. Tiger shot. This is dark, you know. Tiger, I'm like, I show up, man. Listen, my wife, I don't know, I get away, I him do it. That's about my brain. I'm not fool, huh? That's about your brain. Thank God for life, you can kind of journey, you know. Mm. Watch out now, Tiger. Also, along the journey, there was an artist who came about who sounded like Tiger. No. Like a fool. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about the zebra. Only sound so like a fool. Say him sound like a fool. So I never tiger him sound like. Because if he sound like tiger, I'm going to love him. You're going to love him. No tiger two. Tiger one. Me, man. Hunt him and bum bum. Get shot up. Yeah. There is, there is also... You don't um, get shot up here. Yeah. There, there is a word out there that you actually beat up zebra. No. Lie. No, no, God, sir. Knock him in the and say, call the police. Oh, so you never beat him up and no. just punch him? No, knock him in the face and say, call the police in front of the police. Hello, in front of the police. In front of the police. Yeah, look at you and I'm not no lie, you know. Boom, boom, police. Boom. Call the police. So why you did that though, Tiger? Because he did. Because he's telling me that he's my one. And the police tell me, he's a three people thinking he's a survivor, you know. There's a more police. Zebra. So why am I going to try this up on it? And you thump him now? Boom, forget it. Zebra say, are you imitating? Man, I'm going to have a mad man. I'm going to have a mad man. Bop! Call the police. Call the police. Let me want me to. Me knock him out, not me now. Boom! Call the police. Call the police. You've never filed any charges. 
Isso aí faz até que não é não. Não. Ah. Oh. <laughs> There's also words in the street, Tiger, for the people them who really don't know, who, who oftentimes right. confuse Tiger with Zebra and rape accusations are sometimes levied against you. Not like that. Me? Yeah. Me never rape myself much less. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that done right there, sir. No comment up here. Yeah. So I don't know what's the best thing. It's just a thief. You see if I don't want to sell it now. Because, imagine. <laughs> Boy, I'm going to try that nurse. You make it worse. What's going on there, man? Yeah, I know. He's not looking for say, him for a thing. What I don't see, I don't let him for a thing. That's enough. You know? Yeah? But I never know that. I'm all right, so I'm going to take a glass now. Yeah. I say, God is good now. Because I'm going to take a glass at the embassy. Yeah. Up, 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 up. Of all of them. Yes, US Embassy. Yeah. Yeah. And father said, I don't know where I get nine better, but I don't understand what I'm telling you. Yeah. Just like how it's in the Also, Tiger, there has been, it has been well documented that Tiger was involved in, in, in drug use somewhere along his, his, his journey as a musician. You want to talk to us about that? I'm loving it, I'm loving it, you know. Hmm. You want to see. Cocaine has drunk me and said, hey, he would have stopped taking me a kid like that. Jump, yeah. yeah, so jump off of the boat. He jump off. Yeah, so cocaine. He said, I jump off of the boat by taking it. He said, that's what I said, once you start, you can't stop. You might tell you like, that. Yeah, stop. stop. And this time he said, what? Well, I'm a good man. That's what I tell you, somebody stop at your boat. Hello there, God live. Why did you start with a tiger? I said, true, true. Yeah. True, true, listen. Yeah. For a fashion monkey, sometimes you're not doing good. So. A true man. So you were following? Who is a follower, Tiger? Me a follower, it's a follower. It is a follower. And you're like getting a dunk to do, no, do come up, you're talking about the interview, me, Wala. Yeah. I mean, you them, you see them after, yeah? I got it, you know. You yeah. stop. That, the doctor said, me here, the way you said, the doctor said, when you say stop, you can't stop. You, know, you can't work, sir. Yeah. You got, are you got sir? No. So who are you following? Your friends are entertainers. Oh. First thing. You know, God is good. You know? And some, some people are close to me, you know. Yeah. I thought we were friends. Mm. But they want to take my life and my life in. Now have to come again. From the beginning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I respect mean, God who come and say that brethren. You see me I was skillful, I'm a young year. I couldn't play ball and be alive. I said, no, you play ball, go away. They don't tell you. Yeah. You still have play um, ball? Well, I'm mean, looking. <laughs> What's up, what's up, what's up? Yeah. No football now. Mm. Because it's a football, you get the energy. You can start long. Yeah. You start long, you keep doing the stamination. Mm. What? Don't you interview and don't jump up on it. True, that's a true. <laughs> that's that a true. So, Tiger now has been. The journey still continues with recovery, but you have come a far away. Because, as we said earlier, doctors pronounce you dead. Mm. Tiger dead. But Tiger is still here. It's more right. than nine lives, eh? It's, no, one more thing to say about before. Yeah. Them say, somebody give cat nine lives, but at ten, God, you know what I'm saying? Tell them. you get. Because if you want to set a lie and a person who is alive yeah. <laughs> and stop taking coke, I want to be able to bring it back here. Yeah. Dr. Wu, for me, you know, say, I take coke and I stop. Mm -hmm. They jump off and go believe it. Oh, yeah, we're from people and get better. They don't like that. Oh, yeah, we're from people and get better. You can answer. I got to do this one. I'm more than nine lives. Tell me some friends. Ben. Yeah. If that's a good thing, then we got to do it, man. Because mm. my son is total. Yes. My other son is total because a farmer come from. Fire me. come from. Thank God be alive. Man. Did you actually yeah. receive speech therapy? Ah, no speech therapy. No. I was supposed to get it. You were supposed to. The journey is so rough. We couldn't even get speech therapy. That's how rough it was. So you mean, you're, you're, you're suggesting financially it was rough? Mm. Tell that. So, no speech but therapy? I went, I went, I went, I get some, some. So. Don't buy Matthias car. Mm. Early. 
tanke tanke mi 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 in the past uh, five five or so years, he actually went on a tour to the United States in yeah, 2017. I'm telling him, I'm telling him, I go again to don't accept me good like none, none of what I'm telling him. But the influence in me to keep on doing what I'm doing. Yes. You know, finish, so go on. You you still go. have more. Whoa. And they have more, they were telling me, have. Yeah. They were, uh, like, the real expression, you never know, crash from your tail, lies, eh, crash. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Thank God for that, huh? Yeah, people love me. God, it's a blessing. Me. Yeah, that's what I know. I'm just mm. tired of something. Curve it. Keep yes. on right. Out. After you, after after the accident, though, where was the first place that you went to perform? You remember that? Yes, America. America. What was that like, though? Like I was I'm tired of that. Yeah. I really like. I never got to in the end, I do see you talk. Yeah. Yeah, right, man. Yeah. Look, man. Believe me, you know, easy yeah. for me, you know. Mm. Man, just you talk, you get yeah, talk. Yeah, we talk. We talk, you know. We talk, you know. I'm mad, man. That's the truth, man. Can you just talk? You complete, man. But I say, we can't talk. Hello. Look, yeah. man. See, I want I to talk to them to ask me certain kind of questions. Yeah, man. Because some people who end up you go through the gate. Man. It's a joy, man. It's not a problem, Thank man. Them, yeah. Have and you ever gone back on a bike, Tiger? What a question we can answer, we answer, we answer. <laughs> answer, man. I went on a motorcycle in Miami and in England, <laughs> the 50 one by one. Yeah. <laughs> so you weren't scared doing that considering? You see, ride a bike, it's a, it's a surfing machine, it's how you do surfing, you know. Yeah. It's a surfing machine, you can hurt yourself, you can heal yourself, you know. Ah, uh, that deep in a brother. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> You can hurt yourself, but you can't heal yourself. Thank you, man. That deep. That's the truth, man. The people in Brown, did more scared than him. Him? Yeah. We don't know, man. You know, man. You also did sting. I don't remember the year after the top of me. Nah, no, man. You did sting in a, in, in, in a boat. Man. I'm mad, boy. It was either the, the last thing teacher or the second to last thing. Yeah, him just come and pee him just so appear. Somewhere, yeah. somewhere at appear. about 20, 2015, 2016. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah man, yeah, you yeah, see that the brother. second to last thing or the last thing? The last thing. one, that, that last Yeah man, Malvo was on stage, I think a three to four persons were on stage, when mm. I remember well. You're still performing overseas as well? Yeah, and people love me like, wow. Still love you? And yeah, I say, well, you shouldn't cut. Where was the last place you performed overseas? Uh, Florida. Florida. Good reception again. And the people were like, hey boy, tell you, I tell you. Something you hear about, and you go and take for them speech. You know? Yeah. Because something we don't like, or something that I like, say, me, so I have them on the speech. I can't no name, zip. Mm. But what? Can God be alive and tell them to interview me? Yeah. Because I tell them something, tell too. Me, they don't have interview, you know. Mm. But you know why I'm into that, you know. They don't ask a punctual question. Then. Yeah, man. I'm glad, I'm glad to hear that, brother, brother. Glad to hear that. Before. Because you don't do a lot of recording anymore, I'm assuming. You probably a dub plate here and there. But you, you, no. you record new songs? I don't record new songs. Freddie McGregor. With the great Freddie. Boy! <laughs> yeah. That's who release, man. That's who release? You don't want to give me peace? No. <laughs> All right, so. Without, I'm without. Freddie Bex in the You don't want Freddie Bex in the Freddie, I'm a friend, man. You know, Bex. I'm a friend, man. I'm a friend, man. Yeah. You would have voice, as I said before, with, with Supercat. Um, most people only can dream about that. Mm -hmm. Gregory yeah, Isaac, man. Anthony Malvo. Before the accident, was there any. Um, any yeah, the accident, man. One name. Um, ordinary Day. Who your voice that with? Who you know A long time since. Long time. Glenn Ricks. Glenn Ricks. Yeah, they also did time work time. with, with, with um, Fat Boys. And, 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 and not, what's the name again? Not that in so long, man. Yeah, that's good, man. Marcia? No. Judy? No, cause I'm one here. Female, bro. JC, lads. She, she, ah! We got it. So we go down by. Um, go see, see what me have. Go see. Me have. Um, um. I want you to get man. From England, man. Maxi, Maxi Priest. Maxi Priest. Yeah, Maxi the song. Of course, look how long. <laughs> I mean, Dennis Brown. Yeah, look D Brown. Look how long. Yeah, well, I see it. Okay. Zane, my thing. 
Is there anybody we never did work with up to the accident though where you did all, you did hope for, for do a collaboration with and it never get to happen? Or is there anybody you wish you did do a collaboration with in the past? Like a question no. Yeah. You want to see it's a female artist in Jamaica. Yeah. I'm gonna get free card right yet, you know. Mm. Who is that? Judy Moore. Judy. She would have wonder why, but you know what I say? A why? A beautiful woman. Yeah, she beautiful. Was, she, she that for true. You know what I'm going to say. You know what I'm saying. I'm being self, but I know sure I have. Yeah. But who have you said it's still on? You know what I mean? It's still Thank possible. Thank you. Mmm. Let me tell you something, my brother. Could I get some to talk? It's nice to be important. I got permission to be important. But it's more important for me to be nice. You hear my voice? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You put in the work, brother, so as I say, it's an honor. Mm. Yeah, and that's what I mean. So now, what has Tiger been up to recently, though? Good question, no. These characters and I want to tell someone, I want to tell something, no. I watch some people who think they're honest with you, and it's true. Because some make my music, you know. Yeah. Because some people say I'm honest, you know, and it's true. You know. mm. They're not about to kick your head. Speaking about honesty though, Tiger, you would have recorded so many hits and worked with so many producers. What is the situation with your royalties and publishing? Do you, are, you, are you getting benefit? Are you benefiting financially from, from the work that you would have put in down the years? No, I'm not getting right. You know. How come? No, I don't. Because someone inside had a tea when I was a tea, but I'm smiling. And me, me, I feel the love. I feel the pain, you know. Yeah. I feel the pain, you know. Yeah. So after all the struggles that you have gone through though since the accident, none of the men them can look in at themselves and say, yo, even if we never did a do it before, at the right time now for do the right thing. I like to interview you know. They're not ready yet. Most of, I'm assuming. They must be not ready yet. They're not ready yet. So I'm when them are ready. That message, I'm assuming I don't know. Mm. But them who who me. Yeah. But they don't want to play me. Cause I'm a wonder god. Mr. Wagano. Because you know, coming and sitting on the mm. And you're, you're the only part of it you now. One tiger, a connected, simple, truthful entertainer. Yeah. But the fight still go on. And it's not going to stop, you know. Mm. Until they get what is yours. Well, mine then. Mm. Okay, sir. So. The fight goes on. Yeah. So what's next for the great man do? What next? Only me now. Me when me that even though some Jamaican are first me. <coughs> me want be one of the first Jamaican to do a tune with certain American and certain British person. Yeah. And certain Caribbean. To come big in the world. In the world. Mm. You know Still like? possible man. Ah. Still possible. You see, people say now. There are more than one God, or one God can the world. Right? Yeah. So these days it's you and, and, and your family, your, your children. Reality, Tiger Cub, your nephew, your enemy, and those are the persons who are around you. All the while. All the while. You, I'm on Tanga because in faith they are around me. Because when Vagabond around me, in spirit, you know, you yeah. know that, then they can fool me, they can fool me. Mm -hmm. I'm not go for them. Eh? But thank God for your children. Thank God for them all the way. Yeah. They're not neglect neglectful. They're not neglectful. Mm. Like I wouldn't be neither. Yeah. And before you go, I want the island to take care of myself. You know? mm -hmm. I'm not saying, I have to take care of myself. You know? yeah. But in a split second, some bad thing can wreck on. True. You got me. That's a true what I said. In a split second, yeah, some bad things can wreck on. I'm telling you. A word to the wise. That's how we get cushioned up. When we realize that we can't, we say, that's how we can't do it. Yeah. For the people them out there, though, Tiger, the fans, them, the original fans, them, when I talk, the people them who want to pretend. Yeah. When I yeah. say Tiger and I wonder what Tiger did, why you, you didn't tell them, sir? Stay tuned. I'm coming again. Yeah. Simple. But it's true. Yeah. For the people out there who owe a tiger and want to pay up and still have benefit from tiger's work. You want to get spirit up? Go on top. <laughs> what do you have to say to them? Please be true inside 
of God and mankind. Do what you know you have to be doing. Mm. And you have to be doing in the right way. You know, make yourself pay up. Yeah. Do you consider it though, Tiger, looking at it as a miracle that you're around based on the whole situation? Yes. Your journey not finished. But Still more to do. It's a good, good, good miracle from God. Yes. Can you say, live you know? Live, but no, I'm going around here, brother. Mm. The journey has been long and hard, but you're still here. Thank God. Still, I give thanks. Thank God for all the way home from people. Yeah. You see, I do a tune. You know, Fred McGregor. Yeah. And people are saying, he can't record. Yeah. And when Fred yelled, Fred McGregor, this is going to be some number, some one. Number one. Are you, are you alone on the song or are you on Freddy? Me and him. You and him. Where are you? Where are you song near? Two no one talk it, that's why. <laughs> Alright, so with the song still you don't have to talk it. You don't have to talk it, but you understand. So that that'll come out soon. Yeah, everything you look and see you from the highland sea, you know my shit. Yes. Mm. Anything else being worked on in terms of a recording where I forward anytime soon? Yeah. With yeah. Freddie again, see me? No. Yeah. Me tell you, for my label. Your label? Look and see, you know, look and see, you can be. Look and see, you think I don't see it? Look and see. Right, look and see it. Yeah. This is not hide and see, look and see. Mm. This is not hide and see, that's it. Yeah. For the people out there, Tiger, who want to get in touch with it, for bookings, we know I think I'm set away now with COVID, but whenever that opens up back, Tiger still works. So bookings, dub plates, whatever it is, how do they go about getting in touch with the great man? I mean, like a question, I can tell you promptly. My daughter! Yeah, Empress Woman. Reality. Whoa! Reality, facts and faculty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank God bless her. Yeah, reality is running on, man. Are you want to come tell them? Ah, uh, Come yeah, through, man. Pump, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. So just come in and make your ears and, and kind of stoop a little, yeah? No, yeah, Everything yeah, good, yeah, everything. Yeah, so for the people out there who want to get in touch with you, should link up your daughter, Sister Reality. Check, check. Hello, people all over the world, the universe, contact my first daughter. Real, reality, Karen Jackson. Check, check. Talk to them in reality. All right, this is reality. You can contact for anything for Tiger Bookings or Dog Plate. You can contact me on 876-859-8505. Go on and again. You can also follow me at Reality Music and Official Ranking Tiger. Yeah. Thank you. The number again? Yes. The number is 859-8505. Hmm. Got it? Sister, big up yourself. Check. I can wrap up with the general order. Check. Bigger boss, before we go any further still, a long time me I try to get that interview here. Long, long, long time. We got you a whole lot of people hmm. running some place, running one part. But a time, hmm. a job works. Yeah. And I appreciate the opportunity to be able to sit down here. So with a man with me thing is a legend in the thing. You understand what I mean? And despite the accident, despite all of the challenges, it is good to be able to sit down here. So, and even though the thing is not perfect, you mm. still can represent yourself. Yeah, right. You understand? And you still remember your history. And I really and truly give thanks to this opportunity, brother, brother. Yeah. Probably at the in, and I have interviewed many, many artists. Mm. And mm. this is probably the interview where deep down in me, I feel the most pleased about to get the opportunity. Yeah, because when I see the whole of interviews with, with, with Tiger either, mm -hmm. you understand? And as I say, God is good, yeah. even on a bad day, God is good, brother, brother. I know what I like, you know. Yeah, so we are leave the great man with the last words. Tell you what, Colonel people, it's nice to be important. I'm important, you all may be important, but it's more important to be nice to us all, right? To be nice to one another, every time. Take care of yourself, every time. God loves us all. Take a say that out. Mad thing. Big brother, godfather, uncle, daddy, legend. It's an honor, sir. God bless you. It's an honor. Hello there. What's the reasoning? I'm seeing you know glass I'm wearing. No, don't forget to remember. You and you take care of yourself. Parents are very important. Do unto others, you let them do unto you. Okay. No. Bobby love, Bobby love. Tell them all, give Bobby love. Brother, Bobby, no, Bobby, no. Me, I don't give Bobby, no. Wait.
Me love mommy. Me love daddy. Why you feel no me love everybody? I'm trying. Me love the black. Me love the white. Who love on the mic? I want to be like that. No, we live with me. I'm very proud of that. Get that thing away. I'm proud of me. I don't want to fuss around. I don't want to fight. Come like that. Me and sis and bride. Come like that. I want to know my show. Hello. Don't forget to remember. T-Nap in the place. That's a bomb bomb. Thank you. She's a real place, it's a bomb bomb. Can I got that to make a full down? Talking to them long, long, long. Hold on, man. <laughs> hey, more life to you all. God bless. Hey, how are you doing there? I'm coming by you, you know. Careful. Don't go let me know what's going on, I know what's happening, you know. Hello there, I'm coming again. I'm going to tell you something, people. Big up. Big up. Big up. Kuya. Big up, Kuya. I let people make sure that I can't get them. Where am I? Tired of you, Kuya. Teach them. Hey, yo, hello. Send the message and make it reach them. It's Teach Them right here. Warlord representing. Thank you for watching. Please leave a comment below. Remember to like and share the video. Don't forget to subscribe for more awesome content. Follow me on social media and check out the suggested videos on screen. This is Teach saying, until next time, walk good, my friends.